Hi Special Agents, Mrs G back again with some more arithmetic practice. Here are some sneak it subtractions for you. Now remember, these are for Special Agents, eyes and ears only. Don't tell anybody else the top tips that you learn here. Are you ready? Okay, so as you become a more experienced Special Agent with maths, you will know more than one way to work out an answer. So today I might show you two different ways to work out the same calculation. As a special agent, it's going to be up to you to decide which way makes more sense to you and for you to use that way. It doesn't matter as long as you get the right answer, so let's go. First special agent tip, always read the calculation. 92 take away 60 equals. Now don't panic. I've already showed you one way to do this. We're taking away multiples of 10. So you could put six fingers up and you could count backwards from 92. You could also think about the tens here and the ones to help you and do that separately, whichever way is easier for you. So if I do nine tens take away six tens, nine take away six is six fingers up, nine in my head, let's count backwards. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. And the difference between 6 and 9 is 3. And then I've got 2 ones take away no, no ones. 2 take away 0 is 2. If we put 6 fingers up and count backwards ten, in 10 6 times, we will still get the same answer. Shall we prove it? 92 in our heads. 82, 72, 62, 52, 42, 32. Let's practice this skill. Now, first special agent decision. Are you going to put... Uh, fingers up and count back in multiples of 10 or are you going to take away the tens and then take away the ones to get the final answer it is up to you you can write the answers down or you can shout the answers out pause the video if you need more thinking time 78 take away 50 okay so 7 take away 5 7 take away 5 is 7 in my head, 5 fingers up, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. The difference between 7 and 5 is 2. So 7 tens take away 5 tens would be 2 tens. Let's look at the ones now. 8 take away nothing is 8. So 78 take away 50 is 28. Let's look at 94 take away 70. 9 tens take away 7 tens. Seven fingers up, I'm going to count backwards from nine. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. In fact, nine take away seven is two. The difference between seven and nine is two, so I would have two tens left. Let's do the ones. Four take away zero. Four take away zero is four. So 94 take away 70 is 24. Well done if you got those answers. Fantastic. Okay, what about these special agents? 62 take away 30. Are you going to put three fingers up and count backwards in tens? Or are you going to take away the tens and then take away the ones? Okay, so I'm going to do six tens take away three tens. Six take away three is three. Six in my head, five, four, three. Now let's do the ones. Two take away nothing is two. So I get the answer 62 take away 30 is 32. What about 88 take away 30? This time I'm going to put three fingers up and count backwards in tens. 88, 78, 68, 58. Eight tens take away three tens is five tens. Eight ones take away no ones is eight. Well done, special agent. Super subtraction. Okay. Sometimes you might see something like this. 63 take away 10 take away 10 equals. Now, it's two different ways you can work this out. So here comes the choices. I've noticed that I'm taking away the same number both times. So it's just like counting backwards in tens. So I could just count backwards in tens and I would draw an arrow to help me. So 63 take away 10 is 53. Take away another 10 is 43. So the answer is 43. I've also noticed that I'm taking away a 10 and another 10. So I would shorten that in my head and do 63 take away 20 is 43. And I would put two fingers up and count backwards in 10. 63, 53, 43. Because that's just easier for me to understand. Let's try this together. 78 take away 10 take away 10. 
you can jump back in tens twice. I'm going to put a circle around those two tens so I know that I need to do 78 take away 20 to get this answer right. Two fingers up, I'm going to count backwards in tens from 78. 78, 68, 58. Well done if you beat Mrs G. 92 take away 10, take away another 10. I'm going to put a circle around them so I don't get confused and I'm going to remember that I need to do 92 take away 20 to work this calculation out. Two fingers up, here I go counting backwards. 92, 82, 72. Well done special agents, super subtraction. Let's try some more. 45 take away 10, take away 10. I'm taking away 20, I'm not going to get mixed up. 45 take away two tens. Two fingers up, let's count backwards in tens. 45, 35, 25. Well done. Check this bottom one out, guys. 89 take away 10, take away 10, take away 10. Okay, I'm taking away three tens. I'm going to write take away 30 there so I don't forget. I'm going to put three fingers up this time because 30 is three tens that I need to count backwards. 89 in my head, 79, 69, 59. Super subtraction, well done. Now, sometimes a sum can seem more complicated than it is. This says 56 take away something is the same as 51. Now, the equal sign is a balance. We need 51 on both sides. We've got too many on the first side. We've got 56. Can we count on from 51 up to 56? Can we count from the smallest number up to the biggest number to find the difference? And that will help us work out the missing number. So 51 in our heads, let's count up to find the difference between the two numbers. 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. The difference is 5. Okay, so if I did 56 take away 5, I would have 51. Let's try this skill. 45 take away something is 40. We need 40 on both sides. We've got too many, haven't we? Let's count on from 40 to 45 and find the difference. 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45. The difference between 45 and 40 or 40 ta 45 take away 40 is 5. Well done. 58 take away something is 52. So we need 52 on both sides. We've got too many on this side. We're going to do the sum 58 take away 52. We're going to count up from 52 until we get to 58 to find the difference between the two numbers. Are you ready? 52 in our heads. 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58. The answer is 6. Well done, super subtractors. Fantastic. What about this one? 69 take away something is the same as 66. Let's count on from 66 to 69 to find the difference between the two. To do the calculation, 69 take away 66. 66, 67, 68, 69. The difference between those two numbers is 3. Well done. What about the calculation 49 take away something is the same as 41? We need 41 on both sides. We've got too many at the moment. We've got 49 over here. Let's do 49 take away 41 to find the missing number. Let's count up to find the difference. 41 in our heads. 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. The difference between those two numbers is 8. Fantastic. Okay. Now, don't let these kind of sums trick you. They've just moved the equal sign. We need the same number on both sides of the sum, so we need to work the answer out. Because it says something is the same as 19 take away 5. We just need to work out the answer and put the answer in the answer box. They can't fool us, can they, special agents? So 19 take away 5. We want to subtract, we've got to count back. Five fingers up, let's count backwards from 19. 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14 is the answer. Well done, guys. Let's practice. Something is the same as 20 take away 6. We need to do 20 take away 6. Six fingers up, we want to subtract, we've got to count back. 
20 in our heads, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14. Well done, special agents. What about something is the same as 14 take away 3? We need to do 14 take away 3. Three fingers up, let's count backwards. 14, 13, 12, 11. Well done, super subtractors. What about this one? Something is the same as 16 take away 5. We just need to work the sum out. Let's do 16 take away 5. Five fingers up. Let's count backwards. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11. Absolutely super subtraction. Well done. Okay. Now, sometimes when you see box squares underneath the answer box, that's because you can do things to work this out yourself. Now, 73 take away 19 because we we can do seven tens take away one tens year two but we can't do three take away nine you can't move the numbers around we can't take away nine if we've only got three there is a longer way to do this but it's actually faster for you so if we want to take away 19 19 is actually really close to 20 and it's easier to take away multiples of 10 and then change the answer adjust the answer so I will do 73 take away 20 first because 19 is one away from 20 so I'm going to put two fingers up and count backwards in tens from 73 73 63 53 but I was only supposed to take away 19, so I need to add 1 back. Okay, so if we do 53 add 1, we get the answer 53, 54. Okay, so the answer to 73 take away 19 is 54. So if you want to take away 19 quickly, we take away 20 and add 1 back. Okay, take away 20 because that's faster and then we add one back. This is a little bit tricky, we'll be doing lots of this in class. So let's just have a little try together. So let's do 56 take away 19. We can't do 6 ones take away 9 ones. It's going to be much easier for us to take away 20 and adjust. So let's do 56 take away 20 because 19 is only one away from 20. Two fingers up and count backwards in tens. 56, 46, 36. Well done. But we were only supposed to subtract 19. So we need to add one back. 36 add 1 is, that's it, 37. So 56 take away 19 is 37. Okay, well done. What about 89 take away 19? So take away 19. It's easier to do 89 take away 20. Two fingers up, 89, 79, 69. We were only supposed to take away 19 though. So we need to put one back. 69 add 1 is 69. Not 79, we're not adding 10, we're adding 1. 69 add 1 is 69, 70. So 89 take away 19 is 70. Now, some harder arithmetic questions will need this kind of working out special agents. But don't worry, we're in this together. Leave me a like if you'll be tuning in next time. See you next time.